Hello everyone, it's Sean Fake 2 welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're talking about who will be the next companion, and apparently it sounds like it could be Chris Marshall. Now Chris Marshall has been relinked being the next Doctor, 13th Doctor. Now it is rumoured that he will be the actual um, companion. If it's going to be funny if he's really nothing or if he's just a minor character. Now, if the Doctor is a male companion, you're going to get a lot of people like, you know, why can't he have a female companion for this? this is sexist and all that. But then again, you'll say it's sexist because it's a female. A male, sorry. You know, why can't a woman have a female? Then you're being sexist saying it can't be a male then. Aren't you? You're saying it can't be a male because it's, the doctor's always got you know proper female companions. No, it's not always the case. People, we have Jamie with just the doctor. We have um, Tylo, Taylor with just the doctor. Um, I don't know who else is just with the doctor, just the male companion. But you know, those are two prime candidates. I think Stephen Taylor also appeared with the doctor, just you know, on his own in a couple of stories. Um, so there you go, guys. It's not just female companions that just only, you know, the Doctor does like men too. Maybe that's why you're going to say he wants to be a woman. No, it's because he likes, you know, all different sorts of human beings. And another thing, he doesn't, doesn't just do humans. He does aliens too. Tylo's an alien, if you don't know. Tylo. There's a robot. There's two robots, K9 and Chameleon. Uh um, in Doctor Who, of course, there's Nisa, who's an alien. Um, is there any other aliens? Fifth Doctor had some, I know that. Um, Perry's an Earthling. Is Mao Earthling? I think most of them are Earthlings. A lot of them are Earthlings. But anyways, yeah, there's a lot of them are Earthlings. So you're saying that. A lot of people want him to be um, the Doctor. I would like to see him as the Doctor, to be honest. So if he's the next Doctor, I won't even matter. But what if he just appears like for two seconds? Um, it would really wind up people who really wanted him as the Doctor. And wind up people even more who, um, you know, don't want him in the show at all. People really don't want Chris Marshall in the show, some people. Some people really don't want him in the show. Um, but we'll have to see what happens because it's just rumoured at the moment. Same with the rumour that, you know, it wouldn't be a female doctor, it would definitely be a male. It just was who was going to be it. I wasn't even giving it a second thought, it being a female. Now it's a female. It seems like the show is over, really. But, you know, we'll have to see it, is it any good. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Remember, please like, comment, subscribe. To you know some guys, thanks for watching. Take care. I'll keep you up to date who it is, even though I probably won't like it, you know. Um, and probably won't watch it, but I'll keep up to date who it is. If it is Chris Marshall, it's like it should be the other way around. It should be Joe. I know people are going to be saying your sex is now saying the doctor can't be a female, but it feels like if it was the other way around, it probably would work probably much more better if cut, um, Chris Marshall was the doctor and a Jodie Whittaker was the companion. I think they just swapped it around just for the sake of it, you know, to say the doctor can be a female. You know, you know what I mean? Anyways, guys, thanks for watching this video. And like, comment, subscribe. Bye for now. Bye-bye.